missing in one Sacramento County neighborhood are on high alert, keeping an eye out for this man after a violent attack on a woman in the middle of the afternoon. I thought it was a nice neighborhood. I can't imagine somebody. I just can't imagine that. KCRA 3's Richard Sharp is live at Watt Avenue and A Street tonight to explain why authorities say this sexual assault is unusual. Richard. Not only is it unusual, Rob, the sheriff's department says the suspect was wearing something that was so recognizable they believe someone may have seen it, and they're hoping those people might be able to call them and help get this man arrested. Yes. Down here. Yes. Yes. Even the people who live here admit this isn't the best neighborhood. Watt Avenue and A Street. But this latest crime has shocked them. You've lived here for six years. How unusual is it at this time of day? Totally unusual. Totally unusual. What happened was a woman in her late 60s was sexually assaulted. The sheriff's department says violently assaulted. The thought of that just, I can't imagine somebody, I just can't imagine that. I mean, that's horrifying to me. I could be my mom. It shouldn't be happening to anyone, period, but that old. That's just, that's sick. Very sick. What's so unusual about this is the time of the day that it took place, around 4, 4.30 in the afternoon. What's even more unusual, police say, is that the person followed the woman and then pushed her inside of her own home. This person could not have known if this female has anybody inside of her house. This is a sketch of what the suspect looked like. He was clean cut, with no facial hair, a 19 to 23 year old black man. But it's what he was wearing that officers say is very recognizable. Bright red zip up sweatshirt, but tan khaki shorts, not long pants. The sketch of the suspect is already hanging in several businesses around the area. That's really shocking, man, and appalling, exactly because it's an older lady, for one thing, in the broad daylight. The assault is so alarming that some women are changing their behavior when outside. That makes me really wake up. A couple of identifying points here the sheriff's department wants to get out. The suspect's described as 19 to 23 years old, standing 5 foot 8 and weighing about 170 pounds. The victim is said to be clean cut in appearance, and they want to draw attention to the fact that the suspect had on shorts on a day, Saturday, that was cold and rainy. Live in North Highlands, I'm Richard Sharp, KCRA 3 News. Chris, uh, Richard, obviously it's a Christmas season right now.